Good evening, everyone. This is Ben, and tonight, um, because as you know, earlier today, I re-showed my Steven Spielberg movies, and so, for now, in this video, or tonight, I'm gonna be doing another movie review in which, and with, quick disclaimer, I want to mention that I will, some movie reviews that I will be reviewing, some I like to do on camera, myself, show myself on camera, even movies that I don't have, I will, I, that's where that comes in, or some other films. And then, while some reviewers, I'll show myself off camera, like this one and a few other ones. But, but of course, it was regardless of that, um, I have a, another movie review, and this is one of my favorites as a kid. Which, it's a Dr. Seuss film, much like The Grinch, and this one... I know most of you guys don't care for this, but I'm just going to show it to review it anyway, because it's a childhood favorite of mine. And this Dr. Seuss film, as you know, is, that's right, The Cat in the Hat, Hat with, with Mike Myers. Myers, this is the Mike Myers film, of course, and, and so it's, of course, as you know, it's based off the original Dr. Seuss book, and also the 1971 TV special, and... I used to watch this all the time as a kid, and so it's it's basically kind of goes the same way as the book. It's just except with only uh with like uh only with newer characters, and also the brother Sally's brother's name, who is not mentioned in the book, is Conrad, and also uh, other things that weren't in the book, like the cupcake cupcake and ear scene, the couch, and Nevins and all that stuff so it's and also Larry Quinn played by Alec Baldwin he's a new character in this film a new villain so it kind of stuff like that let me get myself adjusted here so it's kind of the plot just kind of goes similar way as the book but except just with newer stuff in it so and I like this movie I mean I know I know a lot of you guys feel about this one I know a lot of you guys don't really like this film that much and I will and but I liked it though I mean look I, mean, I haven't seen this in a while but I mean I haven't seen this film in a while so I gotta rewatch it again but I probably still like it though but you know it's a childhood favorite of mine of course I'm a big Dr. Seuss fan so well I was at the time though but I still am nowadays this is the widescreen version, enormously funny by Jeffrey Lance of NBC TV, which I have to agree with him. Of course, I highly have to agree with him. I know, like I said, and I know a lot. Of, like I said, I know a lot of people hate this movie, and I think the main the main reason that a lot of us people hate it is because everybody thought that there was a major decline in you know humor quality because of the adult jokes in the film. Which I do agree, I can definitely tell by them, especially the, you know, the adult humor in this film, especially the, particularly the part with the cat and the hoe, and also the, the, uh, slow, the slow car, you know, of his previous car, which, as we all know, is a expletive, as we all know, but regardless of that, I still like this movie. I don't, I don't love it nowadays, but I still like it, though. But, anyways, I'm going to show you the disc. Yep, it's a standard blue disc, of course. This originally came in a white case when I bought it, but because I didn't because I didn't really care for those discs made in Mexico stamps, I decided to just put it in a red case. Just to make it kind of more fitting in with the cover. Kind of nice. And so... But yes, I do respect everyone's opinions for those who, who hate it, like a lot of us out there, but there are some who like it. I know Mr. A. Crazy has this on Blu-ray, and he's he's neutral to this film, so, but I still like it. So, so yeah, of course I know lots of YouTubers have this, as well as on VHS, which I'm still looking for the VHS version, but it's alright. But anyways, that's it. For now, this pretty much concludes my review of The Cat in the Hat. And so I'll probably see you again maybe later. Or we'll see what happens. Today's kind of a boring day for me. I know, I didn't go to the Salvation Army today at all because of the snow. So, 
But it's still okay. We'll, we'll still go there, but go there, but probably on Martin Luther King Day though, cause I that's a day off from school, but which, but which is good. But anyways, I'll see you again later for another review.